so what we are going to start in this lecture is first we will be learning posting of a journal entry where the transaction is having more than two effects so if there are three effects how to post that transaction because if there are two effect one debit and one credit we know how to speak that journal entry and how to post that journal entry we post it in two manner suppose the transaction is purchase account debit to cash in purchase account debit side we write down to cash in uh, cash account credit side we write down by purchase but if there are three entries in one transaction three effects in one transaction how to post that into ledger account so we are practicing it and then we will be moving to our example that is yash pani puri and posting all the journal entries so this will be the last step last learning step as far as ledger account is concerned once you know how to post this journal entry into ledger account ledger account technically we are not pending with any points let us take this example purchase account debit to cash to discount so this is the journal entry passed we are trying to post it now three accounts are affected so let me draw over here three accounts purchase account cash account and discount account you need not write it down i'm just explaining you how this will work purchase account i need to write down 1000 rupees on debit side so i need to write down 1000 rupees on debit side but i cannot write it down in this manner to cash and discount right normally how we speak journal entry purchase account debit to cash and on debit side we write down cash account but here i have to write down to cash and discount so what i do is i don't write uh, write it down in this manner the manner of writing is different otherwise everything is same i write down to cash 800 rupees to discount so if you will note i have debited purchase account by 1000 rupees by writing down two transactions two cash and two discount cash account credit side i will write down cash account credit side i need to write down 800 rupees cash account credit side 800 rupees by there is only one option on debit side that is purchase so by purchase cash account credit side by purchase discount account also credit side will be by 200 and on counter side that is debit side there is only one entry that is purchase so it will be by purchase so you can note this purchase account is debited by 1000 cash account is credited by 800 and discount account is credited by 200 this is how i will post whenever there are more than one effect in a more than two effect in any transaction let us take one more example cash account debit discount account debit to sales can anyone raise the hand and give me the effect i will draw three accounts cash account discount account and sales account yes bhavik yes sir yes uh, sir first cash account yes debit yes debit side yes two sales two sales how much 20 20 all right then uh, now in discount account yes um Discount account debit side. Yes. Two sales. Yes. Two sales. Good. Uh, five. Five. And. Uh, and sales account credit side. Yes. Five cash. Yes. 
by discount. Exactly. By cash and by discount. So total will be 25. This is how you will pass, uh, post your journal entry which is having more than one effect. Cash account debit side I need to write down 20. Counter is only sales so I will write down 2 sales. Discount account debit side I need to write down 5. Counter uh, uh, account is sales so I will be writing down sales. And sales account I need to credit 25. So I will credit 25 but by 2 accounts. By cash account and by discount account. Alright. Let me have one more, more volunteer who will try out posting of a journal entry which is having four effects not one not two not three four effects anyone else we'll try out yes neil sir yes uh, sir first we have to cash account uh, just a minute I, i'll draw all accounts insurance company and purchase all right help me out cash account uh, to debit side. Yes. Purchase. To purchase. Yes, good. How much rupees? 500. 500. Yes. Then? Then, uh, bank account. Yes. Debit side. Yes. To purchase. To purchase. Good. How much? 800. 800. All right. And uh, insurance company account. Yes. To purchase account. Yes. Seven hundred. Seven hundred. Now it will be a challenge. Tell me. The purchase account. Yes. Credit. Credit side. Yes. Buy cash. Buy bank and buy insurance. Buy cash. Buy bank and buy insurance company with respective amount right 500 800 yes. and 700 yes. right this will be posting now say if they give you 10 uh, effects you will be easily able to pass the posting effect if you know how to post this type of journal entry which is having more than two effects last one cash account bank account discount account and Sales account. Yes, someone else. Now we will try. Kunal, yes. Uh, cash uh, account. Yes. Debit side. Yes. To sale. Yes. How uh, much? 200. 200. Uh, bank account. Yes. To sale. Debit side. To sale. Uh, 700. Okay. Discount account. Yes. Debit side. Yes. Two sales. Yes. 100. Okay. Uh, sales account. Credit yes. side. Yes. Cash account. My cash account. Uh, yes. 200. Okay. Uh, my bank. Yes. 700. Okay. And my discount 100. Good. So now you all are comfortable in passing a, a posting effect of a journal entry which is having more than two effects. So let us start with our example. And we reached up till 19th of May. So we have done all the entries up till 19th of May. Posting up till 19th of May. Now we are going on 21st May. Purchase account debit 500, two cash account, two discount account. So there are more than one effect. This one I am passing, then I'll ask some student. Purchase account debit side 500 rupees. I will write down two cash and two discount. You need to do it along with me. Two cash, two discount. Cash is uh, 450 discount is 50. Cash is 450 discount is 50. Date is 21st May. 
सो इन परचेज अकाउंट आई हैव ऑलरेडी रिटर्न टू कैश टू डिस्काउंट इन कैश अकाउंट क्रेडिट साइड बाय परचेज 450 21.5 and discount account also credit side discount account where is discount account yes credit side by purchase 50 rupees which is the date 21.5 so where i have given the effect purchase account debit side to cash to discount 450 and 50 cash account credit side by purchase 450 discount account credit side by purchase 50 rupees we have passed this journal entry we can tick mark it let us go to 23rd may and as it is a normal sales entry i am passing it mr p account debit to sales 450 Mr. P account debit to sales twenty third five four fifty sales account credit by Mr. P four fifty twenty three. How I have passed the journal entry, Mr. Uh, uh, Ledger accounts. How I have posted it to Ledger accounts. Mr. P account debit side to sales, sales account credit side by Mr. P. So this will be your twenty five, twenty fifth May. Cash account debit, discount account debit to sales. Now there are more than one effect. So I will require a student who will give me the. effect cash account debit discount account debit to sales and the date is 25 5 yes bhavik try it out hello sir yes uh, sir first cash account yes on debit side yes uh, to sales account. all right 57 570 then now uh, to Discount account. Discount account. To sales account and the debit side. Debit side to sales account. Thirty. Thirty rupees and. Sales account. Yes. On sales account uh, on credit side. Yes. Buy cash. Buy cash. Five seventy and five discount thirty, and it is a twenty-five five. Good, you are correct. Cash discount and sales. We have passed the journal entry, and as, as next journal entry is the same journal entry, I will uh, uh, be posting it in that manner. Cash account debit one seven one zero. Discount account debit ninety. And the sales account is eighteen hundred. Sales account credit side. By cash one seven one zero by discount ninety rupees and it is twenty nine five. So I have posted twenty nine five. Cash account debit, discount account debit to Mister C. All right. We have given uh, while uh, receiving the payment. We have given discount to Mr. C. Cash account debit, discount account debit to Mr. C. Who will uh, pass the journal entry? Who will uh, post the journal entry? Yes, Kunal. Uh, 
कैश अकाउंट यस टू मिस्टर सी टू मिस्टर सी आई आई थिंक इट इज मिस्टर सी राइट यस ओके कैश अकाउंट डेबिट साइड टू मिस्टर सी फोर्टीन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी वन फोर फाइव जीरो इज इट फोर्टीन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी यस यस देन यस डेबिट साइड यस टू मिस्टर सी और राइट फिफ्टी फिफ्टी एंड देन मिस्टर सी अकाउंट just a minute and let me find out mr c yes mr c account by cash by cash 1450 okay and uh, by discount 50 good Okay, I have written date incorrectly, but that is all right. Thirty-one-five cash account debit to bank. Now there are only two effects. I'll give it cash account debit side to bank account. Figure is two thousand rupees. Thirty-one. Five bank account credit side by cash two thousand rupees thirty one five. This I have passed again. This I will be pass uh, passing. You can also pass it on your own. Bank account debit to cash. So bank account debit side. Two cash, thirty one five, five thousand rupees, and cash account credit by bank, thirty one five, five thousand rupees. Drawings account debit to cash. Drawings account debit side to cash. drawings account yes yes drawings drawings account debit side to cash it is 315 what was the figure 500 is it 500 uh, the figure is 500 500 cash account credit side By yes drawings, five hundred. Again, the date is thirty one five. This is posting for the month of May. We are going for posting for the month of June. Now there will be nothing new because we know the posting when there are two effects, when there are three effects. so we will go somewhat fast to uh, post the journal entry cash account debit to loan of rajan 50000 first june cash account debit to loan of rajan 50000 first june loan of rajan account credit by cash 50000 first june we know if there are two effects how to uh, post the journal entry so cash loan to rajan is then loan to mr chohan to cash 16 the figure is 20000 so loan to chohan account debit to cash Twenty thousand one six cash account will be credited by twenty thousand rupees by loan to Johan 
ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड रुपीज सो आई कैन टेक मार्क वॉट आई पास्ट वेजिज अकाउंट डेबिट कैरेज इनवर्ड अकाउंट डेबिट टू कैश now you might have passed a separate journal entry you can post it in that manner i am posting it in this manner wages account debit to cash 2000 2nd june carriage inward account debit to cash second june wages is 2000 let me see carriage is 500 cash account credit side by wages 2000 by carriage inward 500 date is 26 so wages carriage inward and to cash salary account debit to cash 3000 so i will require a new page in a cash account so we can do this salary account debit to cash again two effects so i can post it easily salary account debit side to cash salary account debit to cash date is 3rd june amount is 3000 3rd june 3000 rupees cash account credit side by salary cash account credit side by salary 3000 rupees 3rd june so i can tick mark this 4th june fd in sbi bank to cash again two effects i can easily post it fd in sbi bank 10000 to cash कैश अकाउंट क्रेडिट साइड बाय एफडी इन एसबीआई बी द अमाउंट टेन थाउजेंड सो आई पोस्टेड दिस जर्नल एंट्री फिफ्थ जून कैश अकाउंट डेबिट टू कमीशन सो कैश अकाउंट डेबिट साइड to commission 5th june amount is 300 commission account credit side by cash 5th june 300 so i have posted this journal entry 6th june electricity expense account debit to cash electricity expenses account debit side to cash it will be 6th june amount is 
कैश अकाउंट क्रेडिट साइड बाय इलेक्ट्रिसिटी बिल सिक्स जून सिक्स जून इज आल्सो डन सेंड्री एक्सपेंस अकाउंट डेबिट टू कैश टू हंड्रेड एंड सेवन जून Sundry expense account debit to cash, seventh June. The figure was two hundred. Cash account credit side by sundry expenses, seventh June. Two hundred rupees. Ninth June, purchase account debit fifty thousand to cash to discount. So purchase account debit side fifty thousand to cash to discount. Seventh June. Cash is forty seven thousand five hundred, and discount is two thousand five hundred. Cash account credit side forty seven thousand five hundred. Discount account credit side two thousand five hundred. By purchase, discount account credit side. I have written two thousand five hundred by sales. Cash account credit side by sales. I have written forty seven thousand five hundred. Purchase account debit side. In total, I have written fifty thousand. So I can go ahead by tick marking this one. Purchase account debit to Mister Potatoes. So purchase account debit side fifty thousand to Mister Potatoes fifty thousand Potatoes account debit credit side fifty thousand Purchase account debit side I have written to Mr. Potatoes. Potatoes account credit side I have written by purchase. Next, cash account debit discount account debit to sales. So cash account debit side to sales forty thousand. Cash account debit thirty six thousand to sales. Date is tenth June. Then discount account debit side four hundred. Four hundred or four thousand. Four thousand. And sales account credit side forty thousand. Sales account credit side by cash thirty six thousand. By discount four thousand. So on cash account debit side, I have written two sales thirty six thousand. Discount account debit side, I have written two sales four thousand. Sales account credit side I have written by cash and by discount thirty six thousand and four thousand respectively. Same way bank. 
बैंक अकाउंट डेबिट फिफ्टी फोर थाउजेंड टू सेल्स समथिंग फोर्टींथ सॉरी इट इज टेन टू सो फिफ्टी फोर थाउजेंड डिस्काउंट अकाउंट डेबिट साइड सिक्स थाउजेंड एंड सेल्स अकाउंट क्रेडिट साइड बाय कैश फिफ्टी फोर थाउजेंड बाय डिस्काउंट सिक्स थाउजेंड सॉरी इट इज बाय बैंक राइट बाय बैंक फिफ्टी फोर थाउजेंड एंड बाय डिस्काउंट सिक्स थाउजेंड so uh, this entry is passed bank account debit side i have written two sales 54000 discount account debit side i have written 6000 sales account credit side i have written 60000 in total gentleman account debit two sales 1 lakh rupees gentleman account debit side Two sales, one lakh rupees. Let me write down date correctly. Tenth June. And sales account credit side by Mister Gentleman. One lakh rupees. So I have done this, Mr. Gentleman, two sales. Bed debt account debit to Mr. Gentleman, ten thousand rupees. Date is eleventh June. Eleventh June. I think I've forgotten to draw bed debt account. I can always draw it. So this is my bed debt account. And what is the journal entry is bed debt account debit to Mr. Gentleman eleventh June ten thousand. Bed debt account debit to Mr. Gentleman, eleventh June, ten thousand. Mr. Gentleman account credit by bed debt, ten thousand rupees, eleventh June. so bed debt account debit to mr gentleman i have passed the journal entry i have posted the journal entry then cash account debit discount account debit to gentleman cash account debit side to gentleman 19500 discount account debit 500 gentleman account credit side by discount 500 by cash 19500 what is the date uh, 16 
so even i have posted this journal entry cash account debit to mr gentleman 56000 cash account debit side to mr gentleman 16th of june 56000 gentleman account credit by cash fifty six thousand next one bed debt account debit this we have passed bed debt account debit to mr gentleman 16th june Fourteen thousand to Mr. Gentleman, sixteenth of June, and Gentleman account debit fourteen thousand. By bed debt, sixteenth. So these are having two effects so i am pa passing it on my own you can also pass it on your own bed debt account debit to gentlemen bed debt account debit to mr y 600 and the date is 19th june bed debt account debit to mr y 19th june 600 i will have to find out mr y's account Y account credit side 16th of June by bed debt 600. Bed debt account debit to Mr. Y 19th of June. I have passed the journal entry. Mr. Potato next is three effects, so somewhat typical. Mr. Potato account debit to cash to discount. Mr. Potato account debit to cash to discount 20th June 20 and the figures are 45,000 and 5,000. Cash account credit side forty five thousand by Mr. Potatoes forty five thousand twentieth of June and discount account. I think it is a discount. Discount account credit side five thousand. Mr. Potato account debit side I have written two cash and two discount. Cash account credit side I have written by Mr. Potato. Discount account credit side I have written by Mr. Potato 5000. 23rd May cash account debit to bed debt recovered. 23rd May 100 rupees. Cash account debit side to bed debt recover 23rd june 100 rupees 
एंड बेड डेट रिकवर्ड अकाउंट डेबिट बाय कैश हंड्रेड रुपीज Uh, given to effect, I can go ahead. Tick mark this journal entry. Go ahead. Electronic machine account debit to cash two thousand. Cash account credit side by electronic machine two thousand. डोनेशन अकाउंट डेबिट टू परचेज फाइव हंड्रेड परचेज अकाउंट क्रेडिट बाय डोनेशन फाइव हंड्रेड एडवर्टाइजिंग एक्सपेंस अकाउंट डेबिट टू परचेज टू हंड्रेड परचेज अकाउंट क्रेडिट साइड बाय एडवर्टाइजमेंट एक्सपेंस टू हंड्रेड इंटरेस्ट अकाउंट डेबिट टू कैच फाइव हंड्रेड थर्टी वन फाइव इंटरेस्ट अकाउंट डेबिट to cash five hundred cash account credit by interest five hundred कैश अकाउंट डेबिट टू इंटरेस्ट थ्री हंड्रेड कैश अकाउंट डेबिट टू इंटरेस्ट थ्री हंड्रेड इंटरेस्ट अकाउंट क्रेडिट बाय कैश थ्री हंड्रेड थर्टी वन सिक्स दिस इज आल्सो थर्टी वन सिक्स so what i have done i have posted all my journal entries into ledger accounts